Hi, we're Astronomy Club, and today we're gonna teach you about astronomy. All right, so somebody pick something out the hat. Galileo oh. Galilei. Come on, okay. Galileo. Galileo. Everyone knows about Galileo Galilei, or as we like to call it, Double G. Yeah. Uh, well, everyone knows that this is, uh, he was the first person to create pizza. Back in ancient times, yeah. they didn't have telescopes, like the right? which are which is the cousin to the telescope. So they would use pizza. Right? Yeah. Yes, that's right. Fast. Great. That is good. Dark energy. Okay, all right. Well, dark energy obviously is um, because you see, blackness is not just confined to the earth. Yeah. Darkness expands to the reaches beyond. And the dark energy is what yeah. propels the planets around the sun. Exactly. That's right, that's, that's right. accurate. Yeah, yeah. Grab one. Okay. Go okay. ahead. Let's see here. What's another one? Okay, sweeps 11. Oh. Yes. Sweeps. 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 Okay, so that has everything to do with rings. Yeah. How many yeah. rings are around planets? Yeah. Yeah. Now, if you look close at a, a ring around a planet, it's not an actual ring, it's little particles of dust. And how yes, they get true. there, yes. this, this energy true. sweeps them together. Yes. Yes. And there are 11 of them. Yes, so. 11 is the maximum. Let's try, let's try a hard one. Yeah. 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 This one is a hard one. Yeah. All right. Oh, <laughs> flash spectrum. Come flash on, man. Spectrum. All right. Well, we wanted a hard one, but we got flash spectrum. Mm -hmm. So there, there are these things called gamma rays. Yes, right? yes, yes, yep. yes, yes right. gamma rays. So mm -hmm. when stars explode, uh -huh. it creates a flash. Now this flash, there's a spectrum that we can, using yeah. technology, yeah. 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 you know, yeah. 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 we can see it with yeah. the technology. Yeah. 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 And you yeah. see the, length the spectrum right. of the flash yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. in which the particles yeah. of the gamma ray show. Let's pick this next one. This one, oh, William oh. Herschel. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, not only does he make great backpacks, but he also is space related yeah. in the sense that he came up with the Herschel theory. If you are a big body of mass, mm -hmm. I'm gonna call you a planet. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 William Herschel, Herschel came up yeah. with that. Herschel theory. Oh, I love Billy. What's next? What's next? Synchrotron radiation. Yes. I'm gonna say that in sync. Protron radiation. Yeah. It's radiation that's got a beat, right? Yeah. Because the universe has a rhythm. It vibes throughout space and time, and we're all vibing together. And the radiation has different waves the wavelengths, a big wavelength, a little wavelength. And it spreads radiation. That's what that means. Raymond? Raymond, Raymond Cordova? Yes, Ray. I mean, this is almost silly to say. Gamma ray burst. Yes. You know, my my grandmother, you know, on my, on my father's side, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Used to, she used to, she had a little problem drinking. Mm -hmm. And she'd act out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, and sometimes I was the victim of that. So we used to call my house so gamma ray burst. Yeah. Yes. Energy yes. is what's in space. And energy yeah. is always going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, you can you can ask about this. Yeah. One time she whooped me so bad, that energy is still out there. It just keeps yeah. going. Yeah. 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 Let me just get one of these. You yeah. know. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I went to school. Yeah. All right, what we got? All right. Molecular glass, I mean, gas clouds. Yeah. See, the thing you don't know about the the the, the small, because that means small. Sometimes when you're on the elevator, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. And someone just and someone just lets one go, huh. and all of a sudden you're like, ah, get me off this elevator, but you don't want to open your mouth because of the little the little gas clouds are so small that it goes into your mouth, mm -hmm. and now that that has gone into your body. So now wow. that person has disrespected you. Disrespect. Because they didn't know that your mouth was open and now the, the molecular, ga ga you gas. know, gas. Say it, brother, preach. You know what I'm saying? It's in your body. So, so it, you're saying uh -huh. molecular gas clouds are from farts. Yeah. But how does that then translate into the stars? Yeah, the astronomy. You know, the... Is that when the planet rotates, what it's doing is, is that it's letting out that gas, but it doesn't want to smell it itself, so it has to move away. So it keeps... It's, so, it's, 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 so it's trying to run away from itself. It's avoiding its own Because it don't want to get in its own mouth. It doesn't want to get in its own mouth. far is like a comet, right? And it's a rot and it's then entering a different yeah. celestial body. And now you guys know a little bit more about astronomy. And if it doesn't make sense, well, you don't understand metaphors. Yeah. yeah. That's kind of what you It's do. your fault. It's, it's your fault. If you want to learn more, keep watching Astronomy Club, the sketch show. On Netflix, maybe you'll learn something.